fairly fair uh, in terms of the very large communities that add additional days, additional hours because they have such volumes. What What is your response on that? And I appreciate that uh, question because it, it's not about government jurisdictions, it's about voters. <coughs> Uniformity and fairness is about treating Mary Smith that lives in one county the same way that Mary Smith gets treated in another county. It's not about uh, having different rules for different voters. That's not fair. Fair is when everybody plays by the same rules. And in, in elections, uh, we should have uniform days and hours. If you look at, at some of the court rulings that came out, uh, particularly in the Obama case, the judge uh, in that particular case assumed that we would set uniform and fair hours across the state. And I consider that part of complying with the federal court ruling as well. And so, but rather than have um, these hours set at the local level or, uh, or by a secretary of state, I would prefer that the General Assembly adopt the bipartisan recommendation of the Ohio Association of Election Officials and we set this issue aside. Um, because it is, it is very easy to vote in Ohio. I want to reiterate, every single voter in the 2014 in general election will get an absentee ballot sent to their home, and if they fill it out and send it in, they'll have five weeks, as it is, stands today, to cast their ballot without ever leaving home. Uh, and if you don't like, and if you don't like the idea of sending your ballot off in the mail, you could fill it out and take it off and drop it at the drop box at the board of elections. Uh, you never have to stand it. 